What's going on guys, Bills here from Achievement Lands and I'm here with an Achievement Guide for Wobbly Life and this is for completing the temple. The temple is all the way on the right side on the island. You need to fly there or take a boat or hovercraft. Once you get over there you want to come to this temple. First thing you need to do is take a bomb and bring it up to the door. We need to blow open the door. So pick up one of the bombs and drop it right in front and it will ignite and then just step back. There we go. Now you want to pull the door and push it so they can get through. And inside is the elevator that we're going to take down. So it's not that hard to get through the temple. There's a few different puzzles, but they're nothing crazy. So first we just have to go past these axes. No problem. Now we're going to go into the next room. So this room has a ray of light that you need to bounce off the mirrors and hit the switches to open the doors. There's one on the right side. We don't need to go in that one. This one activates the path straight ahead and that's the way that we need to go. And then there's one on the left side and inside there's a chest with a present in it. But we're not going to get that right now. So we're just going to move around these statues so we can direct the light over to the switch so we can open the door. Now you're supposed to shine it over to the left to the next statue and then shine it to it, but you can actually activate it from here. So there we go, the door's open and now we can move along. The room that was in the right gives us the answer for the next puzzle, so that's why we didn't need to go in there because I'm going to tell you which way to go. Alright, so here we are. You just have to go the same way that I'm going. You gotta walk the same path on these certain tiles. If you walk on the wrong one, they're all gonna drop, and then you're gonna drop too, and then it's just gonna respawn you at the door right behind us. There we go. There's a chest over here to the left that has some presents in it. Now this is the ball puzzle here. We have to use these and get the ball across and then it's going to bring it down and then we can get the ball. We're going to use the ball to unlock the next area, but the ball is actually needed for another achievement as well. For unlocking the ghost pet, we need to get this ball and the one from the waterfall and we need to bring them both to the mine. So just remember this ball, we're going to use it later. You can even do it right after you finish the temple. You can go back and get the ball and just work your way back up so you don't have to go in the temple twice and do the puzzles over again. So I'll link below the video for the other uh, achievement as well for the ghost pet in case you want to do them both back to back. So yeah, you're just going to keep spinning these and uh, working the ball over. It's a pretty easy puzzle. It just takes a little bit of time.
Now this one actually moves the bottom one as well. So once you get it down in this bottom one, you're going to turn it over to the left and it's going to go down the ramp. There we go. Now we can pick it up and we're going to put it on the altar in front of us. And that's going to move the big ball out of the way so that we can go to the next area. Like I said, that we need this ball for another achievement. So just remember it. You can come back and get it. After you get the achievement in the temple, you can just work your way back and then grab it and bring it with you on the way out. Or you can come back another time and do the other achievement if you want. So just keep walking down the path. The big ball is going to roll past you. Just hug the ball and it won't hit you. It takes a bit to walk down this path, but eventually you'll reach the end. And now we're going to be in this room, and it's a little bit of a maze. You want to go to the door to the left, and take a right inside, and then make a left into this door. Make another right, and follow this down. There's a chest over here with some presents. We're going to go down here, down the stairs. And there's a door to go through. And then in here is the final room. And the final puzzle. So just walk around until you get to the middle. And there's a little panel with four buttons. We have to do a Simon Says puzzle. It's going to show the lights at the top. And we just have to follow them. So we just did this one and then this one. It's going to always be the same pattern. So you can copy what I do. There we go. Once it's done, we can go across the path. And inside here is two chests. So just open them up and go in this room. And that's going to unlock the achievement. And there's a button in here. You can use that button to get the elevator to go back up. But that's it, guys. That's how you complete the temple. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this video helped you. Leave a like if it did. And I'll catch you guys next time here at Achievement Land. <laughs>